very animated discussion. But let's try to have one conversation at a time because I promise you it's going to be really interesting. Everyone's thing said. What happened first? What's the first thing that happened? Yeah. Every dream uh, team came together and checked what else we need and what can we trade. And uh, so, so you what, looked at what assets you so had. So what, what we had exactly, and so what's the most, yeah, the, the, the cards in need and, and, and what we could give away. That okay, was, and what did you find when you looked at the cards? There were only four decks. There were four decks and how many teams? Five. Five teams. Aha. <coughs> uh -huh. How is that like real life? Limited resources. There are limited resources, right? There's not always enough for everyone to have everything. Okay. So you had to figure out some way to deal with that. What was the way you thought about what you could do when there are only limited resources? What were the solutions you came up with? Yeah. We formed a big commune. You guys form a commune. That's really interesting. Why did you form a commune? Yeah. I think Andrew. partly because some of us were familiar with similar exercises and we knew that that would give us the best outcome. So, no, but I think this is important though because from like past a, experience, we knew what to do to some degree. So, you knew about the past that, you know what, if we actually break down the barriers between our teams, we might do better. Right. Okay? So, that was something that you were considering. Yeah. I think also that we, we realized that we were just kind of arguing about who was going to get what cards. So, then we said, okay, let's break up. Um, one of the teams, so then there's four teams, and then once we had done that, then we said, well, we might as well all work together. Okay, so once you basically said, let's just ban and just give out our cards. Yeah. Okay, now, what are other things that one team could have done? Let's say that you decided you stay separate, what could have happened? Yeah, Andrea. Uh, we tried to gather extra resources, so we got duct tape from the other room. Okay, but this is different. I'll, I'll get to it in a minute. Okay, but the idea is, what are other things you could have done besides merging? Yeah. I was suggesting a Dutch auction, so you basically, you have a, a monetary system based off cards and the rarity and how much their need is, so supply and demand system. So, okay, so some